In this video, we're going to continue looking at 3x3 three three ad digit addition, but now we're going to carry a little bit. So what if I added 987 plus 113? Well, again, I've lined everything up, and first I add 7 plus 3, and that equals 10. 7 plus 3 is 10, but that gives us 1, 0, and 1, 1 in the tens column. Now I have 80 plus 10 plus 10 in, in the next column, and I can think of it as 8 plus 1 plus 1, and that gives us another 10, but this time that represents 100. So we don't need to repeat this 0, it's already written here, but we'll put this 0 in the tens place, and then this one in the hundreds place. So now I have one plus nine plus one, or a hundred plus nine hundred plus a hundred. And what does that equal? Well, this is a thousand, another hundred, eleven 1 hundred. So one thousand, one hundred. So what do we do with this? Well, these, right, nine plus one plus one, the eleven should go here just like it is in 1100, because this represents 1000, and the next digit represents 100. So, in this case, the first carry led us to carry all the way through, and that will often happen with addition. Just keep carrying as you go along. Let's try another one. What if I had something a little bit less friendly, like 987, and I wanted to add 799 to that? Okay, well now we want to add 7 plus 9 first. And what's 7 plus 9? Well, that's 16. So we put the 1, 6 here in the 1's column, and then the 1 in the 10's column. So now I have 1 plus 8 plus 9, or really 10 plus 80 plus 90. What's that? Well, 90 and 10 is 100, plus 80 is 180. But again, if I was thinking of it in simpler terms, I can think of it as 1 plus 8 plus 9, which is 18. But that 18 is different. The 8 doesn't go in the 1's column, it goes in the 10's column, because it really represents 180. And then the 1 goes in the 100's column, because the 1 in this 18 really represents 100. And now last, I have 1 plus 9 plus 7. That really means, of course, 100 plus 900 plus 700. And here, what does this equal? Well, I know again that these two numbers add to a thousand. So if I add a thousand to 700, I get 1,700. Or if I think of it as 1 plus 9 plus 7, that would give me 17. Now this 17, the 7 represents the hundreds place, and the 1 represents the thousands place. So we have to be careful with that carry. But anyway, that's the basic idea. I hope it helped.